Welcome back to Shay and the Dogs. Today we're finally continuing Eden's journey with part two of the Border Collie Chronicles. This little fluffball has been with us for a whole week now and let me tell you, it's been one whirlwind adventure. Of course, we've been watching closely as Leia, our two-year-old Labradoodle mix, adjusts to having a new furry friend around. So far, it seems there's a lot of curiosity and a few tentative sniffs and wagging tails. As you can see, we took things slow and Leia was quite curious about her. This week has been packed full of a bunch of firsts. Eden's first walk in the backpack around our downtown Denver neighborhood. We're already gonna have to size up our canine sports sack. First bath to wash off our travels and even our first popcorn party, which is a little tradition that we started the first day we brought Leia home back in 2022. From there, Jack actually already had a trip in the books, so I had a few solo days with the pups, which I loved, and immediately got busy puppy proofing the house, figuring out her perfect meal and potty schedule, and of course teaching her basic commands, like sit. She's a fast learner, and let's just say, there have been a few accidents along the way. I think a lot of people get puppy fever and glamorize the stage of a dog's life, but I think it's important to remember that bringing home a new puppy is a responsibility, equal parts exciting and exhausting. Eden is full of energy and curiosity, which means I've set up a routine for her meals, playtime, and potty breaks, not to mention I think I've gotten a total of eight hours of sleep between the last two days. And it's been a learning curve for both of us, but seeing her happy little face makes it worth it. And not just looking at it from a budget standpoint, but also making sure that she's the right fit for us and our lifestyle and being able to meet her needs as an active dog breed. And speaking of happy faces, our resident heart dog is slowly but surely warming up to her new little sister. There have been some playful nips and stolen toys, of course, but overall they're starting to develop a really sweet bond. And it's heartwarming to see Leia taking on a protective role and showing Eden the ropes of apartment living in the big city. prepared to give both of the girls, you know, adequate space and time to get used to sharing a space together. The most heartwarming part of this week has been watching Leia and Eden develop that bond. At first, Leia was a little unsure, but now they're practically inseparable. They chase each other, cuddle up between the X-Pen, and are obsessed with playing bitey face, which is really cute. I feel really lucky because I know some people really struggle with reactivity or dominance issues with their dogs, especially being two females, but this is so much better than I could have hoped for and I really have to shout out our breeder Gina on this one for making sure the puppy really fit what we were looking for.
Making time to meet up with friends, grab coffee, and get outside has also been a welcome break in our schedule and reminds me to keep my head up on those days where I'm really feeling overwhelmed or frustrated. It's so beautiful being able to show this tiny soul her first glimpses of the world and even take her on her first hike. <laughs> of love and lots of laughter. While Leia will always be our heart dog, again, and the reason we started sharing our journey with the world, Eden has already added so much joy into our lives and we can't wait to see what adventures they get up to together. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more, and leave a comment below letting us know what you think of our new edition. Until next time, this is Shay and the Dogs signing off.